Hi, I'm Lou with another episode of My Car Story. I'm here with Chuck. Chuck, nice to see you. Nice to see you. What's your last name? Hufty. And Chuck has a great car. Um, you know, I like Mopars. This is a great Mopar. And you'll see why this is the case. So Chuck, what? first of all, thanks for the Dodge hat there. What did you bring here today to the car show? It's a 1968 Dodge Coronet RT. And with the Dodge Coronet RT, yours has got the 440. Why this car out of all the cars in the world? Uh, I've always been a Mopar guy. Love Dodges, love Mopars. Give me a little bit of background about that story you told me uh, at the beginning that you became a car guy. How'd that happen? Um, How, what age were you? Probably seven or eight. Uh, <laughs> my best friend and I jumped up on the, the uh, bumper of his grandmother's DeSoto and took, <laughs> popped the hood, took a look at that Hemi, and I've been a Mopar guy ever since. <laughs> That's all it took. Come on, let's go take a look at your car. Come on right next to me. All right, so we've got... I've seen this car at a couple of other car shows and I've been waiting to do it. So Chuck, it's really a treat. Look at the beautiful squared styling here of this car. And it just, the all bright RT. And I wanna show you the side of this car. Just very stock in appearance and, and style. Let me get this shot right back here. That's the Coke bottle. <laughs> the Coke bottle, That's you said. So this is where the, the little dip in there comes in, giving it that Coke bottle style. When did you, now you said you had this car in 99 you were sharing with me. Yes. What, uh, uh, is this car been completely restored or what? I mean, it looks fantastic. Yes, it was a total uh, rotisserie restoration. How long did the restoration take? Uh, that I don't know. Okay. I, I'm guessing about a year. <laughs> well, the car looks fantastic. Let's take a look at the front. Oh, that's nice. That's real nice. Chuck, what's the reaction when people see you driving in this car? Uh, a lot of them have never seen a car like this, so... Usually uh, they get kind of excited, and if they're car people, they get real excited. <laughs> yeah, right, right. Let's pop the hood for them. Oh, well, let's, you know what, let's go into the interior momentarily. May I open this? All right. And we've got the Coronet RT. There you go. There's the door here. The Coronet RT there. The mirror. This is for this piece here. Lots of room in the car, very comfy. I like the up the middle piece here. Let's go over some of the gauging here. They call that the tick tack tack or tick tock tack, is it? Or yeah, tick tock tack. Tick tock tack, thank you. 150 speedo. The other pieces. The eight track, nice. I'm gonna just do this for just a second so people see how that works. And then the eight track goes in like so. Couple of gauges, not a lot of interior badging, the automatic there, and what they look at out the front. Let's take a look under the hood. That's nice. That's real clean. I see a little hooker header upgrade there. But other than that, we've got the 440 Magnum. Just like that. Wonderful. Well, Chuck, let's start her up. Let's see what she sounds like. That's a nice. Oh boy. Chuck, 
Give me just a little, just give me a little gas. <laughs> you see this one more time. I shut her down. Come on out, Chuck. Stay right there next to your car. That that has a wonderful sound to it. Yes, it does. <laughs> That'll make you smile. A little bigger cam than uh, came with. The Holy motor. cow, that's a wonderful <laughs> car. Hey, Chuck, it's really been a treat meeting you. I've been looking forward to doing your car. I've seen it at a couple other car shows. Thanks for being on my car story. Thank you.